Navigating in AutoCAD We use navigation in order to work with a large drawing in our workspace. So how to use navigation in AutoCAD? The save first is the select and panning. But first we have to create a drawing in order to practice the tools. So I'm going to create a circle here by pressing C and press enter to activate the circle. I'll just create here and, and press enter again to enter the previous command. I'll just create a random circle here. And uh, I'm going to create a rectangle. Press rec and press enter and create a, rec create a rectangle. Now how to use the navigation in AutoCAD of select and panning. You can use the select and panning by clicking the scroll bar. Click it and hold and you can move around. So you can do that by shortcut of scroll. Also you can click this on the right part which is pan. Once you click that and you can move around. Say you have a drawing here and you want to see, you can find it here. And you can cancel it by pressing the escape key, press escape key, and it will cancel the command. Second is selecting the drawing. Let's say I'm going to select this circle. You can click it and by selecting it, you can click this also. You can hold shift if, if, if you want to deselect this. As you can see, there's a minus symbol there. So you can reduce the selection by holding the shift and select. By left click you can press also ESC to deselect all the selection so you can do that now let's create a selection window there are three type of selection which is selection window crossing window and lasso selection first is the selection window that you can click on the on the top here and hover to the bottom left select window is let's say I'm going to select this but half of this circle it will select only within that rectangle which is the the selected uh, object but since i select half of this it will not select this one so you can press esc to cancel that the crossing window is let's say i'm going to select this i have a selection of you can start the selection from bottom right and going to the top left the crossing window since i select this half so it will it will be selected unlike the selection window it will not be selected so that's a way how to use how to select your drawing press esc to cancel the selection third is the lasso selection tool you can Customize your selection by using the lasso selection. Click on this and hold the click and you can create a shape. Let's say I'm going to, all, to select all the circles but the rectangle I will not select it. So you can use the lasso selection tool or the lasso selection. So you can do that. Also, in both a uh, selection window and crossing window, you can use the lasso, the lasso selection. Also, in order to zoom your drawing, you can uh, you can scroll use the scroll bar. Scroll up means to zoom, and scroll down is to zoom out. Zoom in to scroll up. Zoom out is to scroll down. Also, you can find some tools here let's say full navigation wheel it will show a wheel so you can zoom orbit for a 3d pan you can move around but it's easy to use the mouse only also pan zoom extend it will extend the drawing orbit if you are working with 3d if you want to rotate the object in 3d dimensional also, you can use this. You can use this also to rotate your 3D objects, and you can click the ESC to cancel it and and press the top, and it will back to the top view. 
can move around so that's navigating in AutoCAD I hope this video tutorial helps you don't forget to like and subscribe thank you for watching